Who's gonna walk that bridge with me? The road to this album hasn't been easy. It's been lined with disappointment and setback. But we never gave up. And now, it's time to show the world who we are. A rock and roll band with a relentless passion and drive, like an African lion stalking its prey in the savannah, never ceasing. I'm a drummer. I'm a drummer. Yes, ma'am! You know, I love telling stories and I love playing rock and roll. And I've always wanted to do both. We're kind of like a very large, loud gag fly. We've had uh, eight drummers, so we've had complicated relationships with all of them. Oh, you can talk about the first time we went to Occupy Wall Street. We shot a video at Occupy. And then the police told us to stop. And my songs are about fractures and scenes, not only fractures between people, but within people. People seem to connect with them. It makes me think. Wild and raw and amazing. Go into a show and there's just so much energy. David, want to say a little bit about what it's been like playing the band? Oh man. <laughs> You know, this album is really the culmination of actually years of songwriting. The opportunity crystallized to work with Kieran Kelly. Kieran's worked with some fabulous people, including Sufjan Stevens. Lucas's music is uh, tied to the pantheon of rock and roll. The title One I King seems to encapsulate a thread throughout my songwriting. You get songs and lyrically explored living on this constant brink of apocalypse. The music that he's making is, is, um, Something that deserves to be heard. You can see he's got equipment here, including, um... Man, I wish I was better at explaining this shit. Cause I don't wanna do we need money to finish mixing and mastering as well as finish recording the album. We need your help. The one I did about breaking guitar strings on stage. About feedback. About the abyss looking back into you. About being 20-something on the eve of the end of day. Getting it on the ground floor of our first full-length album. Sorry, I'm excited. It's an exciting thing. You know, sometimes I don't even remember. I'll just be practicing and I'll look down and I'll be bleeding all over my guitar. And most of the time I clean it up, but I thought I'd keep it just as like a historical record this time. 